you know, in connection with all this uh, global warming and uh, environmental discussion, I was looking at uh, just the history, and I do a lot of this. I, I, I try and uh, juxtapose different areas of science and, and different areas of archaeology and what things are saying about our world. And it's very interesting that in the so-called last ice age, and the melt-off of the last ice age, it supposedly occurred somewhere around 10,000 BC, thereabouts, okay? And on the archaeological side, I've got all of these uh, incredible megalithic structures, like the Great Pyramids, for instance, all being built around 2500 BC. And uh, there's a profound thing that's happening in exploration right now, is that, that ex explorers, archaeologists, are discovering all of these incredible civilizations that lie at about an average of about 150 feet below uh, present-day sea level. And the great civilizations of Mu, you know, off Japan and Indonesia and the Mediterranean areas, you've got these incredible megalithic block structures, cities that exist at about 150 feet below the surface of the ocean. So if I have a melt-off of an ice age at about 10,000 BC that would have raised the oceans to this level, but I have those oceans covering cities and structures that weren't built until 7,500 years later, I've got an issue there because there's no archaeologist that's saying we're building that type of structure until 2,500 to maybe 3,000 BC. And the earliest accounts of the melt-off of the last ice age doesn't get much later than 9,000 BC. So I've got this huge gap that doesn't make any sense to me. Why do I have ancient civilizations built in the same structure as the Great Pyramids lying at about 150 feet below the ocean surface? I say check this out for yourself. There is a disconnect between what mainstream science is saying in two different areas of specialty. And somehow those have to come together or the evidence doesn't make any sense. I'd also ask you to check into the record of a great deluge, a great flood, that would have also caused these types of world events, could have caused a, a, an ice age that would have melted off uh, at a time much more recent in uh, history.